good morning. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I have a word for you this morning. Many things are going to start being announced, my children. Some of them are meant to scare you because that is a way of controlling you. When you hear these things, come to me for protection and comfort. Read Psalms 91 daily, like I have asked you to do many times. Watch and be aware of your surroundings at all times. When you come to me, be still and know I am your Lord. I will whisper in your ear what I want you to do at that time. Know that things are coming. It's Satan trying to frighten you and to doing the wrong thing. But my children will come to me and seek confirmation. I will give it to you. I talk to you, all of you, my children, daily. But your ears are still closed. Just be still and be in a quiet space so you can hear me. You will have a shocked look on your face because you will realize that I am truly talking to you. Take your instructions seriously so I can position your feet and the way they should go. Many of my people are looking for a safe haven. I am preparing them, but now is not the time to go there. It is the time for you to move to a safer home. Get away from the coast. Sell your property and go inland or to the mountains. Find other jobs and I will continue to protect you. The safe havens are going to be used near the end and they are continuing to change as I direct them. They are not meant to be a place for you to simply give up your life and live off them. Continue with your life independently. As I have said before, the wealth is about to be transferred to the righteous. Stay close to me at all times. Keep your ears and eyes always hearing and seeing what is before you. They are going to be a lot of my children who are waking up to a new situation and they are going to need you to help them to make it through. Show them understanding and love like no one ever has before. Help them to handle what is occurring and how the world is changing. There is a spiritual war happening in the heavens. It is a war between good and evil. I, your God, will win and the world will change due to it. Satan is very angry that he is losing this battle. And his minions will come after your mind and your soul harder. Be not dismayed, for I have said it in my word 365 times to fear not. This battle will soon be over. Always remember how much your Heavenly Father loves you. Amen.